accused of killing a two year old Modesto boy last October and five people inside a Modesto home last week appeared in court for the first time this afternoon. KCRA 3's Linda Muma is live at the Stanislaus County Jail with how he pleaded to the charges. Linda? Kelly, tonight Martin Martinez pleaded not guilty to murder and abuse charges in the death of Christopher Ripley. His court appearance came just hours after he was brought back to Modesto from Santa Clara County. And tonight he sits here on $5 million bond while police continue to investigate the five other murders. Family and friends of the two adults and three children found dead inside an East Modesto home were in court as a judge read 30 year old Martin Martinez his charges in another case. The arraignment here today was very quick. Um, Mr. Martinez pled not guilty as a standard in a lot of these cases. While he wasn't there to answer to the charges in the murders of five people last week, including his own mother, girlfriend, and six month old child, he was in court to answer to the death of his girlfriend's two year old son from a previous marriage last year. Currently, he's charged with two felony counts. The first one is murder of Christopher Ripley, two years old, last year, late last year. And the second count is a child abuse count, 273A, it's the penal code section, which is also child abuse, but child abuse causing death. Martinez was arrested Sunday in San Jose after seeing a movie with his father and was initially booked into the Santa Clara County Jail. He was transferred to Stanislaus County overnight to face charges this afternoon. The possibility on each count is life imprisonment if convicted. Prosecutors believe Martinez murdered two year old Christopher Ripley in October. According to the criminal complaint, Martinez is accused of causing great bodily harm resulting in the boy's death. And while he's now suspected of killing five others, so far no charges have been filed. Is he a threat to himself or other people at this point? No, certainly not. He's already been through our classification team and appropriately housed. And if any of that were to be the case, they would have let us know and they would have housed him appropriately or taken whatever steps they need to take to ensure his safety. And to ensure his safety, the sheriff says that Martinez is being held here at the Public Safety Center instead of the downtown jail. He's scheduled to appear in court next week. Reporting live in Modesto, Linda Muma, KCRA 3 News. Linda, thanks.